Hey, what's going on guys and girls? I'm Colleague Phoenix here and welcome to episode number two of my V Rising solo playthrough series. So, we've got to go fight another boss. We've got to go fight Keely the Frost Archer if we want to be able to continue our quests. So we must go find her. And I believe she is this direction, according to the blood trails that we are uh, following. Does this mean anything, this, like, altar piece, or is it just like, this was a castle at one point and now it's destroyed? I think that's all it means. And we can't cross the water, which really sucks. We have to go around it. Hopefully you guys and girls enjoyed the first episode of this series. I don't know how many we're actually going to do, but I am enjoying playing this game, so it's probably going to be quite a few at least for now. I'm gonna try and do quite a few episodes of this. Go around this pond as well. Now, I don't know how far into the... Into the map we're going to have to go to find Keeley. Okay, we've got a few... A few wolves here, and I just missed that. Okay, we really can't feed on them. While we're getting attacked by others. So the feeding mechanic is definitely, you know, made to not. The hell is this? Why is there crystals underneath it? Is you gotta get something else out of this, right? When it breaks. You have to. Crude emerald. Crude topaz. Yeah, yeah, you do. What's up here? Got to do some exploration. We have a goal, obviously, but I do want to at least look what this might be. That's a bandit camp. Okay. Cool. Let's do it. Oh, we get some paper from these guys as well. How well is that working for you, champ? only going to get 1%, but let's do it anyway. Oh, we got anything good here? Anything in these boxes that we can partake in looting? Or do we just do this for the, the enemy kills and the resources we got from them? That seems to be the case. I don't think there's anything else around here that we can use. Oh crap, sun's rising. Try and get in the shade. Now hopefully, oh man, you look nasty. What the hell? Oh no. Okay. You are kind of nasty. Hi, can we... Can we not? I'm going to hit you again. Damn it. Oh, we can feed on you. Well, that sucks for you, brute, doesn't it? Thank you very much for your beautiful patronage. Now, are we faster in wolf form? I don't know what the advantages of wolf form are yet. Like, we tried it last episode for a very small amount, and I realised that in the sunlight we still burn. We definitely are faster. Okay. Whoa. It hurts. Okay, where we gotta go now? Come on. This way. Still continuing on with this way. Come on, Keely. Where are you hiding at? Don't burn me. I'm going to have to go up here, which is going to burn me. Ouch. Ouch. Come 
Come on, Keely, where the hell are you? We must come and kill you. So we can get the leather recipe unlocked. To make progression. Probably up in here, right? Bandit trapper camp? Oh, shit. Okay. This is gonna be fun. Get out of the sunlight, it hurts. Eighty one per cent. Okay, this is a bad decision. Oh my god, you look humongous. What the hell are you? Oh, it's a tree that's alive. Oh shit. I'm stuck. Hey, they're fighting it. That's good. This good. This good. This gives me blood men time. They are fighting a goddamn tree that is alive. What the hell is that? That is insane. Oh my god, now it's fighting the moose. Ah! Okay, we got some rats on us. Let's eat that. Get our blood up. Okay, so he's killed all the things, which we can now consume. Yeah, we're not fighting that. Ouch. I'm burning to death. Oh my god. Crap. Ah, oh, that's what counter does. Crap. Oh my god. Oh shit. Quick bit of blood mending. Oh! Bring him over to the tree. Hey guys, there's a tree over here. Oh shit. Yes, 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 yes. You don't know what I'm doing. Oh, I'm dead. No, leave me alone. He doesn't know where I've gone. I don't want to fight the pissed off tree. Oh, shit. Holy crap. The hell is that? Will not quench your thirst, but can be useful in other ways. Um, we probably should make some of this. That'll be better than the rats, and that'll give us health. Okay, breaks upon taking damage, the effect, but that's fine. Okay, it's night time now. We don't need to worry about burning to death when we're trying to fight enemies. So that'll at least help us with fighting. Okay, so don't trust trees that look like that. Good to know. Surprise! Oh, what the shit? That bear looks pissed off. Oh, he's just covered in blood. I can feed on him, though. Thank you. Oh, your EO are here. 
Hello, Keely. How you doing? Oh. Yeah. Moment. Let it be more difficult. Oh my god. You miss. You go invisible? You think that's gonna work? Okay, that hurt a lot. Yes! Oh my god. Shit. Shit. I'm dead. Fuck. So this this is the thing that sucks. Like, if you were playing with other people, you'd obviously be able to have them, you know, help you. Oh, okay, there's a way gate near it. Awesome. Oh, great. There's a rogue right here. That's good. I'm real happy about that. I need your blood. Thank you. We're coming back, Keely. This isn't over. Just because you killed me doesn't mean this is over. You're going to get absolutely rinsed. Great. There's more brutes and shit going in there now as well. Son of a bitch. Oh, shit. What the fuck? There's a faith? Shit, shit, shit. Okay, we have to play this really, really, um, carefully. Try and get multiple hits on people and stuff. Ah, ah. Okay, let's just get our stuff. Let's just get our stuff. Let's just get our stuff. Shit. Leave me alone. Winter's come early. Oh, fuck off. Hit my ass. Okay, can we stack it? You can indeed. I wonder if she heals. I hope not. Come here. My god, that trap is crazy, though. Got you. What you gonna do, bro? You little shit. God damn. Okay. A lot of loot over here. Chilling on the ground. Well, what was that? It's exactly the same. You did... You did fucking heal. Son of a bitch. Come on, come over here. 
Ah, you moved. Oh, really? Don't back up to the enemies. Come over to me. And I dodged into it. Come on. Get you again. You got me again. Oh no, terrible. Whatever shall I do? Absolutely whiff my, my hit. Gotcha. Stop backing up to the enemies. I'm gonna drink this while you're dicking around. Ah, damn it. Come here. Oh no! Ow. Dick. Hurry up! Take your time doing your heal bullshit. My god. It's fine. We're gonna- we're gonna get her. We gotta get him. Come on. We good. And you did slip up. It's your time to go. I'm sorry about this. But it had to be done. Hmm. Delicious. Swaps abilities. Got illusion abilities. Okay, so we don't have any new abilities unlocked. Oh, vampire powers. Mm. Emotes. Oh, frost. We do have one. Launch a projectile that explodes upon impact, dealing 100% magic damage and inflicts chill on surrounding enemies. Huh. Chill. Okay, I'm just healing. Uh, what would I want to swap it for? A shadow that deals 200% magic damage. So, you, you gain less magic damage, but you gain the fact that they can freeze. So I guess in some ways it's good and not good. I don't know how to really perceive it. You got anything hiding in these tents? Maybe enemies? Oh, yep. Of course there is. Why wouldn't there be? You prick. It's not very effective, because he can just shield and block and counter your shit. Yeah, and then you get stunned when you go and hit him. Okay, we killed him and a trapper that was hiding in here. Sorry, my daughter was in here talking to me, so... I paused the recording. What do we got now? Blood Rose Seed. Coarse Thread. Let's take what we can and drop... Mmm... The sawdust. For now. The sun is rising. Okay. 
Let's just blood mend quickly. And then let's make our way back to our base. After a successful journey. That is salvageable, but do we really need it? No. I don't think we do. Let's just take the sawdust back. We need to go make some chests. The hell are you doing here? Oh my god, they all respawned. Fuck this place. Go! Oh my god, they're still following me. Holy shit, you're joking, yeah? Hey! Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 hey. If I go into wolf form, will they attack me? No. That is very helpful uh, information. Wait, will they? No, they, like, run with me. Get out of here, rogue. What do you think you're doing? You think you can just wander around my land? It's an unsullied heart. Or oh, paper, yes. Very good. We want that for research purposes. Oh, I think we can... Can we just go to the vampire way gate and teleport our way to the other way gate? Is that how they work? Or is it going to be like, you can't teleport with these items in your inventory or something? That's probably what it's going to do, huh? Because I know it says some items are not teleportable. Go away. Oh man, you guys are about to get absolutely rinsed. Fuck are you? You boss man? Holy shit, you are. Ouch! Oh, okay, I'm dead. Uh, at least the way gate's right there. It also, unfortunately, doesn't seem like I can, um, change any of the server settings after I've already created it, which really sucks. And I think that's a bit silly, honestly. Can we get this without taking damage? Looks like we can. Our inventory is full. Um, it won't quench our first, but it can be useful in other ways. What other ways? That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to drink the water. I don't know. It must give us health or something. I have no idea, honestly. Uh, let's make these, and then that will get rid of the rats, which means we have the inventory space to pick that up. Oh, son of a bitch. I was just trying to find the path up to that way gate, and I went past the road for it. So now I've got to go all the way around. Oh, thank God the moon is rising. Okay. 
Okay, we don't want to go up there. We just want to continue on our way around this rock. But I'm pretty sure it's only going to let us teleport some of the items that we have on us and not all of them. Because that seems to be what the description says. Unless there's some other teleport ability that it's talking about that we can't use. That I just don't know yet, but... We shall find out. This is all experimentation for me. Like I said, I've tried to avoid watching stuff on the game. And people may be sitting there screaming like, Oh my god, you're so dumb. Why do you not do this? Why don't you not do that? Well, this way, dude. Um, probably played more than I have, so, you know... Hold it to teleport. You cannot teleport while carrying resources. Fuck. That sucks. I don't think I like that game mechanic. I'm telling you that right now. It does at least give me a, a marker when I do that. For where I have to go. But that really does annoy me greatly. I should have seen if there was a way to uncheck that. And I bet you there is, and I just didn't notice it. We are frailed. Does that mean we take more damage more? Oh, no, because I accidentally ate the fucking heart. I bet you that's what it is. I accidentally ate that. Alters your blood type to frailed. Son of a bitch. Well, we needed a bunch of copper anyway, so this is good. We've got... Okay, max is 400 stack. At least for the settings I have on, which I think increase the stack size to double the amount or something. We're going to have to go and make a chest and put a bunch of this stuff in it for sure. Oh, why am I doing this? I should be just doing this. There we go. I'm going to definitely kill these guys because it looks like we've got a chest back here. That interests me greatly. And we definitely then need to upgrade to at least copper gear. You. Oh, my inventory is full of blood essence. You're kidding, yeah? <sighs> the planks. We can always get more planks. Blacksmith components are used for crafting weapons. Again, can always get more, more of that. Can be used to trade purchase items from merchants. Take the f carrying silver. Does this hurt me? Oh no, it heals me. What the fuck? I go into wolf form. Does it hurt me though? I think it does. Yeah. Interesting. What is this as well? Bring this book to a research desk to unlock the technology. Aha. So you can just find books with tech in them. Are you sleeping? You are. I'll just go around. Yep. Catch you later, dude. Now I'm taking damage. You take damage over time based on the amount of silver you're carrying. Okay. In combat, if you are in combat, you do not regenerate health. Uh-huh. So I was regening health before somehow? Okay, so carrying silver doesn't heal you. It damages you. That makes more sense. That's why I pop out of wolf form, because I start taking damage. Like I'm taking damage, so it pulls me out of wolf form. Let's grab this. Right. We're almost back home. 
We'll be able to make some copper gear now because we'll have all the materials we need to do that. Just needed them mats, bro. Them mats. And we definitely want to make a... We definitely want to put stuff in the chest. Like the silver in the chest so we stop taking damage now. Let's come over to our small stash. Open this up and put the silver in there. There we go. Okay, let's go to the research desk quickly. The frozen eye. Magic sources increase magic level and boost the power of spells. Okay, let's also just put all these gems away. These random gems we have. We'll probably put some of the blood essence away, honestly. We don't need so much blood essence on us. Nor do we probably need all this copper on us. Okay. Let's go to the forge over here. And let's put... Oh, screw it. Let's just put all of it in there. Let it do its thing. Unconfined castle room. I don't know how that works. We'll also probably need to make a blood press as well. Which means we're going to need planks. Oh, we have a shitload of planks actually. Let's make a blood press. Which way is it actually supposed to face? I don't know. I don't know what's front and what's back. So we now have a blood press. What do I do with it? There's no interact button with it. The workstation used for extracting essence from biomaterial. Okay, there we go. Aha. Uh -huh. So that becomes... Exquisite hearts become primal blood essence. Unsullied hearts become greater blood essence. Vampires use it to control material to unlock sealed knowledge and to convert humans into obedient servants. Right. We have those in here, don't we? And I do have it backwards, I guess. Which is kind of annoying. That's going to take a hot minute. How's this going? It's chugging along. Reduces the cost of refining materials when all the floors in this room are forge floor. Increases crafting and refinement rate when placed within an enclosed castle room. i to figure that out too. What they mean by enclosed castle room. Because I tried to enclose it and it didn't seem to do anything. Oh, there is a tannery. There we go. We just unlocked that because we killed, uh, what's her face? Which means now we can convert some of this into leather. Fish oil and pristine hide becomes pristine leather. Plant fiber plus leather becomes empty canteen. Useful as a liquid container. Use it near a liquid source such as a river, lake, or well to fill it. How much did we need for the castle heart to be upgraded? We needed 12, which we already have on us right now, so let's do that. Nice. Now we've unlocked the blueprint mirrors. I don't know what that means. Oh, here we go. Now we've got floors, walls, and stuff. Aha. Build walls on foundations to enclose rooms. Encapsulated rooms will generate ceilings. Uh-huh. So we need floors. Missing resources. What the hell do I need for it? I don't know. Stone, I guess, probably. Mirrors. This magic mirror allows you to customize your vampire. Ah, okay. 
Yeah, it makes sense, because the palisades are meant to be your outer walls, and then everything else should be your your inner walls. Like, that's... That's like, uh... Yeah, yeah, it makes sense. Which means these palisades are going to have to probably be deconstructed and moved to be wider again now, because they're going to be in the way of us building out our building. I mean, hopefully I've built in an area that's going to be big enough for me to build everything I want to build. Foundation sections for building a castle. Missing resources. But what resources am I missing? Complete a castle room by laying down floors and building surround castle walls to generate a roof. Track and defeat V-Blood carriers to unlock new technology and recipes. So is it just there and I just don't have it? It requires a connected blood heart, but then you come in here and it says I'm missing resources, but it doesn't tell me the resources that I'm missing. So he tells me these. Wooden stairs, stone stairs. Like, it tells me that. But then you go to castle and it doesn't tell you shit. Stone brick. Aha. Okay, so I imagine that's probably the same for the floor then. Grinder. Into bricks and dust. We need four copper ingots. We need two more wet stones. And we need four planks. How does one get wet stones though? Reinforced plank. Can we make wet stones in here? Maybe? Yes. We need stone dust and copper ingots. Oh, it's an unknown recipe, though. Son of a bitch. Who the hell do we need to fight for that? Woodworking bench. Big stash. The devourer. Five-fingered the uh, whetstone. We need to kill Grace and the armorer. Damn, man. Okay, fair enough. Did we really blow through all that copper already? My god. That's ridiculous. Uh, we have more. Let's put more in there as well. Get that going for a minute. And we need planks to upgrade those. Which I don't have more of right now, which I can get more of, of course, but now we did not have it. I didn't put any planks away, did I? No, I did not. I put some copper away, though, which probably could put some more in there. Where the hell is it? Well, I just split the stack and left it in the box, didn't I? That's what I did, right? Yep, that's exactly what I did. Moron. Okay, tannery. That is done. We now have 26 leather. Don't really know what else we can do with it, but... Oh yeah, we can do this, right? Am I going to have enough to make all of it? Yes. Sweet.
Let's equip all the things. Now, what do I do with this? Transfer items from your inventory of the type of item exists in the container. Man, those swords and stuff are expensive on the copper. We're going to definitely have to get a lot more of it if we want to actually make those consistently. Uh, so, let's get... What is that? 8.9 physical power, 25% physical damage. 8.9. Okay, so that's vegetation. That's creatures. The spear seems to be the actual weapon. And the sword is, like, more for getting plant fiber and stuff. And that's it. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, let's test it out. Yeah, he got he got destroyed. We messed him right up. Killed him. Right, so we've got plenty of copper. What the hell do we do? Can we break these down in the tannery or something? I don't want to repair them. I want to break them down. I don't want to just drop them on the ground. I figured there would be a way to break them down, though. Fishing pole, sculpted wood, painting frame. So I'll probably go kill Rufus the Foreman next episode as well. We can sleep. What does that do for us? Does that just heal us or something? I don't know. I don't know what that actually does for us. Let's just have another stash as well. We'll just... Let's put these in there for now. Because I just don't know what to do with the... Those. Not sure yet. We can make a Traveler's Wrap, which means we take less damage from the sun as well. But that's... Yeah, okay. Fair enough. Alright, well. Anyway, guys and girls, that is going to be the end of this episode. If you liked it, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more V Rising in the future, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media links down in the description below. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all have a lovely day. Alright, peace!